congratulations to today's daily shout out winners if you want to win a shout out leave a nice comment down below for a chance to win a shout out in my next video i see no difference it's one of your kind don't feed them at midnight i bought a gremlin just because i kind of remind me of angel if you guys agree drop a like on this video and if this video gets to 20,000 likes maybe i'll get angel a gremlin costume just because she looks like this gremlin you guys can't even deny it she looks like a baby gremlin anyways guys hi welcome to my channel if you guys are new here hi my name is lissy be sure to subscribe button because we are getting so close to 2 million subscribers and if you guys have not subscribed yet be sure to hit that subscribe button also really quick before today's video starts i do want to say i have a gaming channel and a vlog channel and i've been posting a bunch more on those channels so i'll have them here on the screen on my gaming channel i'm going to be posting all sorts of different gaming videos and fun things like that and on my vlog channel i kind of get behind the scenes of my life and just random stuff that i want to share with you guys anyways guys in today's video we're going to be talking about drones that captured really scary things on camera that are almost unexplainable i'm sure we all know what drones are those little things that fly around you can put a camera on them and they capture footage of stuff i've used them before i once you know accidentally crashed a drone it was a fun time anyways today i scrolled across the internet for stories of scary camera sightings that happened on drones and we're going to talk about these scary sightings that are almost 100 unbelievable the tea is hot let's get started so the first scary thing that was caught on camera by a drone was actually apparently bigfoot if you guys don't know who bigfoot is let me tell you first off when i was young i loved bigfoot and i was one of those crazy people who watched like every episode of finding bigfoot and i literally would go out into the woods with my friends and i'd be like trying to make Bigfoot sounds and summon the actual Bigfoot and it never worked and I was really sad about it because I thought that if I could catch the actual Bigfoot that I could sell him and become a millionaire or something like that so I really did believe it. Anyways there is drone captured footage of someone who claims they might have found the real Bigfoot. It's funny because a lot of people always ask like how did Bigfoot even start? Well it actually started because somebody who was working at a construction site found a really weird footprint in the construction site they were working at. The footprint was huge and it was a 400 pound weight so they decided to name the mysterious creature Bigfoot and that's when people started to search for this creature and they were looking around everywhere trying to find who Bigfoot was or what could have left that unexplainable footprint in the ground on that construction site not only that but since then a lot of people have tried to find the actual Bigfoot and there's been tons of rumors of people online claiming that they actually had seen the real Bigfoot there's lots of videos photos and conspiracy theories and stories of people who claim they have heard and seen and dealt with the real Bigfoot apparently when Bigfoot walks by the ground shakes because he's literally that that heavy so he's someone you would not want to mess with well in this video footage caught on a drone as you guys can see there is some footage of Bigfoot this drone footage was actually captured on March 4th of 2012 in the city of Salt Fork Ohio in the USA so as you guys can see in this video the drone ends up taking off over a weird forest kind of like an open land and then eventually later on in the video you guys can see a weird dark shadow figure that almost looks like the exact shape of a real Sasquatch or a real Bigfoot the drone ended up crashing though and it was kind of weird timing of how the drone magically crashed during all that sighting. But let me know in the comments down below, do you guys believe that Bigfoot might be real? And do you guys think that the drone footage that was captured might have shown the actual Bigfoot? Comment down below letting me know what you guys think. Next scary drone sighting. So the next really creepy drone sighting we're going to be talking about is called the ghost in a white dress. And that's kind of a coincidence because I'm wearing all white today. This one's about the black eyed children of Canock Chase Forest in Strathshire, England. There are rumors of ghosts who linger these areas due to an outbreak that happened in the 1800s. There was also said to be victims of the Raymond Morris who took the lives of several children in the 1960s on this property. Cannock Chase is supposedly rife with paranormal activity everywhere and a quadcopter drone may have recorded one of the Cannock Chase ghosts as it flew past the drone. So these woods already have a very high amount of paranormal activity so somebody thought why not fly my drone around the woods and see what we can capture. But they ended up capturing something horrifying. Literally might have have captured a real ghost on camera. So in this video, as you guys can see, there is a drone flying over top of a bunch of trees. They give a zoomed in view though, and they see something a lot more strange looking in between the forest trees. It appears to be a ghostly like figurine standing in the trees that's almost unexplainable. So they keep zooming in with their drone and the footage that they get is absolutely terrifying. 
I have no idea what that is, but if that was a real ghost, yikes. That is very unsettling. It almost looks too big to be a regular person from that distance, so let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Did they actually capture a real ghost girl wearing a white dress in the forest? Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Could just be a sheet hanging from a tree, but who knows? Next scary drone capture. So the next scary drone capture we're going to be talking about is actually a volcanic explosion. This volcano is called the Vanatua Volcano. Sometimes when volcanoes are about to erupt, obviously people can't get close enough to it, so they have to send helicopters or drones or something that can be safely evacuated from the area, so they decided to send a drone over to this volcano that was about to erupt to get some scientific information about this volcano. The volcano has a seven and a half mile wide caldera and its active craters contain ever-flowing lava lakes. I mean, look at this volcano. That is scary. I would not want to be anywhere near a volcano if it was about to explode. I don't know about you guys, but I even get scared about having to hike up a volcano. When I went to Hawaii, I had the option and I kind of thought twice about it because being in a volcano eruption would be my biggest nightmare. Literally, I do not want to get burnt to death. But some people have to go out there and risk it all and get the scientific data with these volcanoes, so of course they send drones out to do that. But volcanoes are very dangerous and very scary. Next scary drone sighting. So the next scary one we're going to be talking about is called the Cornfield Clown. Kelly Lopez of Huntsville, Alabama took their drone over a spin over top of Cornfield and discovered a very strange sighting of a visitor. This visitor happened to be not just any regular Billy Bob Joe, but a clown in the middle of a cornfield, just chilling all by himself for no apparent reason. You cannot miss this orange hair figure who appears about a minute into the video before spotting the drone and running into a wooded area nearby. Either way, hoax or not, the whole idea of clowns just scares me a lot in general. I mean, when I was little, getting a balloon animal from a clown was honestly fine, but I feel like now clowns have became a lot more scary than they should have, and I'm a little scared of them. If I were out in a cornfield, you know, at a farm, and I all of a sudden saw that, I would be terrified and I would run away super fast because there's no way I'm about to be in the middle of a cornfield or in a cornfield maze stuck with a random clown because that's terrifying. Are you guys scared of clowns? Let me know in the comments down below. Next creepy drone sighting. So this is going to be the last one we talk about and this is another weather related drone capture. So if you guys don't know anything about tornadoes, well, I grew up in Minnesota where we often always had tornado watches, tornado warnings, wall clouds, and tornadoes merging from the sky, ready to rip apart the entire earth beneath us. So tornadoes for me are absolutely horrifying. Um, I know a lot of states and a lot of places don't deal with them, but I've seen my most of tornadoes. Luckily, I've never been struck by a tornado. That would be the worst. But people often, you know, can't get close to a tornado, so they would fly drones up to get footage of tornadoes to try to get scientific information and get information about the cloud that's about to form. So in this video here, as you guys can see, a drone got super close to a tornado, which obviously, like I said, never ever ever get close to a tornado that is super dangerous if you see a tornado you want to get out of there ASAP because tornadoes will literally rip apart everything that it comes across like it will destroy buildings it will fly cows into the air literally they are terrible but this drone caught footage of an actual tornado in action and I find it horrifying never ever go near a tornado kids they're they're really creepy and if you guys have never been in a tornado watch you're lucky because that's scary now I got earthquake warnings which you know I'm used to it I'm a Californian never had a really bad earthquake yet. Hopefully San Andreas chills, but at least we don't have tornadoes. Anyways, guys, that's going to be it for today's video about scary sightings that were caught by drones. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, be sure to drop a like on this video and hit that subscribe button because we're getting so close to 2 million subscribers. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Be sure to check out all my other channels linked in the description down below. It's been Lucy. I love you guys and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. God bless you guys. I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys. So that was it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to hit the subscribe button, be sure to drop a like, and be sure to leave a comment down below. I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.